how cool was it to have Letterman on your show when you started out watching Letterman? It was crazy. I mean, I, I didn't just start out watching Letterman. I had Late Night with David Letterman book covers. I made buttons with his face on them. And I heard you had a personalized school. tag on your car. Uh, my license plate on my car said Late Night. I had a Late Night birthday cake. I was a full-blown stalker. And somehow, I don't know how security let me in here, but they're not doing a very good job. Well, I miss Dave himself, obviously, but I also miss there's a comfort in knowing he's there. And um, the, the fact that he's not there to kind of give his perspective on, on things is, I think, makes us um, unsafe as a country. Well. I'm happy you're here. I'm sure Dave is happy you're here. I'm going to stay behind you for the rest of the Facebook Live or whatever. Okay, okay? that's fine. All right. Well, that's what we're here doing right now, people. It's the Mark Twain Prize for American Humor. I'm Roy Wood Jr. This is presented by Capital One. We'll be honoring David Letterman later tonight. You can catch that broadcast November 20th on PBS. There will be many people in the building tonight. Jimmy Kimmel, as you can see, Bill Murray, Amy Schumer, Steve Martin. Martin Short is over there somewhere. I'm not scared. You, you can't get him. Him. Yeah, go get him. Marty! He's far away. Do you have to yeah. keep talking till he comes back? No, we can toss to the hallway oh, if we want, but you're the here. Hallway. Okay. It's an empty hallway. No, it's the hallway you just left out of. All right, well, let's toss to the hallway. We'll be back with more red carpet exclusives.